Hi guys, this is Sajak from Dragon.com and in this video, we'll show you how to fix the issue of local install missing from your OnePlus phone as well as how to fix the issue of local install being grey out on your OnePlus phone. So as you could see in my screenshot, it's currently grey out and on my phone as you could see, it's currently missing. So I'll show you how to fix both of these issues. So as you might be aware, the local install is something similar to the ADB side load which is there on other phones. Using this feature, you could manually install or sideload the update zip file. You could download the update zip file from an app such as Oxygen Updater app or from third party websites such as XDA. And once you have got the update file, you could then manually install it as well. However, in some cases, the local install option might be, be missing or it might be grayed out. So let me show you how to fix both this issue. So first off, let me show you how to fix the issue of local install being missing. For that, all you have to do is simply turn on the developer options on your phone and you will get back the local install option. So go to the settings menu, then go to about device. From here, go to version and tap on build number seven times. You will get a prompt that you are now in developer mode. Once that happens, it will enable developer option. So go to additional settings and you should now see developer option. As you can see, this is the developer option. So with this, we have also got the local install option. Let me show you that as well. So let's go to about device and Oxygen OS and tap on the overflow icon at the top right. And with this, we have got the local install option. However, as you could see, the local install is still gray out. So why is that happening? Well, this is happening because the system has already given us an update in the form of, in my case, it's the 31052. It could be any update, but if the system has given you an update, you cannot overwrite that update via the local install. So you will either first and foremost have to install this update and only then you could access this local install method. But as of now, we don't want to do that. Instead, we want to skip this update and we want to manually install the update zip file that we have using the local install option. So how that could be done? Well, for that, first of all, make sure you have enabled developer option. Once that is done, you will now have to simply turn off the Wi-Fi as well as carrier data. Once you have turned off all the internet from your phone, you will now have to go to the settings menu. From here, you have to go to apps, then go to app management, tap on the overflow icon at the top right and select show system. And now you will have to search for the software update app. So let's, let's scroll down to the software update app or you could also use the search bar to get this job done. So go to the software update app, then go to the storage usage section, tap on clear data, then tap on delete. Once that is done, you will have to close this as well. Then you may now go to the settings menu and from here go to about device, then tap on oxygen OS. And now you will get a no network connection from here. That is not a cause of concern. Simply tap on the overflow icon and you should now see the local install option. So just tap on it and choose the required zip file, the firmware zip file which you want to flash and select it and it will now verify it and then you could simply tap on extract and it will now extract and install the update file onto your phone and the process stands complete. So just to repeat, if the local install is missing, then you just have to enable developer options on your phone and it will then be visible. On the other hand, if the local option, local install option is gray out, then apart from enabling developer option, you will have to turn off your Wi-Fi and internet. Once that is done, you will have to remove the data of the software update system app. Once you have removed the data of that app, you will then have to go to the settings and about device section. And now you will be able to see the local install option without any issues and then you could tap on local install and manually select the update zip file of your choice. With this, it will now extract the zip file and install it and the solution will take up to a few minutes depending on the file size. So guys, on that note, I round off this video. If you have any queries, do let me know in the comment section and thanks a lot for watching.